Meanwhile, if you haven't voted yet, an Ohio college student is trying something different to make sure you can find everything you need to know about a candidate. Spectrum News 1's Sheena Elzey shows us how he did it and how his research could make an impact. When Sam Hyken voted for the first time last election, he was frustrated. I was looking for voting data on uh, my, my congressperson, and I found that it was very difficult to find. That's when he got to work. An hour per day. An hour a day for months. A lot of coffee. Researching candidates on government sites and putting together computer codes. This is just what's being displayed to the user. That make up this, a website called who did I elect? Well, I decided to create a website that allowed you to find that, that voting information by your congressperson rather than seeing who voted on a particular uh, piece of legislation or bill. And eventually that grew into adding um, all different types of data onto the site and creating like a whole overview of the congressperson. This computer science college student says he picked up the coding and researching skills to create the site through his studies at Miami University, something John Fimiani, a computer science professor, has been showing students to do in class. We're looking at techniques for remote sensing. He says with more advanced technology, students need these skills to stay competitive after they graduate. One of the things that's happening more and more is the amount of publication and experience that you need just to get through the door to certain places has gone up. There are certain master's programs where having undergraduate research experience can really be the gateway to get into that master's program. Sam Hyken is graduating this school year. And while he says he has no plans to go into politics, he hopes his research will help someone else vote. And he's not done yet. I still feel that it's a work in progress and there's always things that can be improved. So, you know, I'm still spending a lot of my free time making sure it's as good as possible. I'm Sheena Elsie for Spectrum News.